Welcome to Virtual Lab at NITK. This is the instructional video of the experiment PLC Retentive Timer on Instruction. In our experiment, we want our motor to run for a predetermined time, say 50 seconds, before it is sent for maintenance. So, the Retentive Timer instruction of 50 seconds is used to track the running time of motor for maintenance. Here, one switch is used to turn the motor on or off and one push button of normally open type is used to reset the timer. The working status of the motor and timer is displayed using LEDs. When the motor is running, motor on LED will glow. When the motor is not running, motor off LED will glow. When the timer has done timing, done timing LED will glow. Now let us see the simulation. If we close the start switch, the timer will start timing. Let us see that. Now the timer has started timing and the motor is running. Hence the motor on LED will also glow. Suppose if we open the switch now, the retentive timer on instruction holds the previous value that is accumulated value is 32. Now if we close the switch, the timer will start running from 32 that is previous value. Hence we can see that the retentive timer holds its values. It retains its value. Now once the timer has done timing, the motor stops and motor off LED will glow along with the timer done timing LED. Now in order to reset the timer instruction, return to timer instruction, reset button is pressed. Students are advised to observe the timer instruction, also observe the LED and motor correspondingly. Thank you.